All right. Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, learn intermediate CSS by building a cat painting. Step nine. All right. So CSS positioning lets us set how we want an element to be positioned in the browser. It has a position property so we can set to, pardon me, it has a position property we can set to static, absolute, relative, sticky, or fixed. Once we set the position property of the element, we can move the element around by setting a pixel or a percentage value for one or more of the top, right, left, or bottom properties, all right? Uh, static is the default positioning for all elements. If we assign it to an element, we won't be able to move it around with top, right, left, or bottom. So we're gonna give the cat head uh, class selector a position property of static, and then set the top and left properties to 100 pixels each. All right, so we already have the cat head already made, and so here's the stuff we did before. And what we're gonna put here is position, position is now static, all right? And then we're gonna say top is 100 PX and we'll say left is 100 PX, like that. And like this said up here, when we have it static, it doesn't do anything, right? So that's why it looks exactly like it did before, right? So let's uh, do this anyway, check the code, looks good and submit it. All right, now we're on to step 10 and We'll see you next time.